Hello and welcome to the Popcorn Junkies trailer reaction. Uh, Maddie. Yes. Introduce us to what this is that you told me has landed. So yeah, Five Nights at Freddy's is a really, really popular horror game. Um, it's like a jump scare type right. horror game. Uh, you're, I think there's now like eight games. Right. Like they've had, had eight different ones come out. Um, and from what I've heard, this film is going to end up being, this is going to end up being a trilogy. And this ah. first film is just like, I'm guessing the first game, <laughs> right. which is where you basically play um, a security guard. Uh, well, like you're on watch, night guard watch. Yeah. Um, and you're just basically sat in an office room with this uh, voice message playing on the phone. Yeah. And they're basically telling you like what to do, you know, check the cameras. And it's all very eerie because they're saying, you know, you want to make sure that you keep your eye on the animatronics. So you're working in a place where there are animatronic, yes. uh, you know, like robotic animals. It's yes. like a kid's cafe, right. play area type. Thing. Yeah. Um, and the thing is that uh, of a night when it's closed, they have a mind of their own and they eat people. So you've got to stay awake and make sure you don't get killed by them. Oh. Um, so it's like the worst horrific end of Toy Story. Yeah. <laughs> so uh, it's a really good game, and I tried to play it, and it's really hard to play. Oh my god! But so my favorite thing, ones. yeah, my favorite thing is um, watching Markiplier play it, and like everybody's a Markiplier's a YouTuber oh, who right. does gaming videos and oh, okay. like makes films. He's got a new film coming out, and there is there are people who are saying that there's rumor of Markiplier being a cameo in this because ah. he's said to be like. The King of Five Nights at Freddy's, because... Ah. So is it a cult? Kind of it's a cult. I'll tell you what I've been drawn to is some of the figures. I've got a figure in there of, of one of them. I look, it's like a teddy bear, isn't it? With a sort of animatronic teddy bear. Yeah, they're like, like big, well, they're big robots. Yeah, yeah, it's a bear, a bunny. I and mean, they almost have things chicken. like that in their eyes and stuff. Yeah. Like that. yeah we've got them. I mean, Freddy is the bear. Right. Uh, I played it. I tried to play it on an app. I think there's an app version of the game. I tried playing it on a handset once. Couldn't literally move past a CCTV camera. Uh, I've only played it on PC. Uh, is, and is it a PC game? It's not a uh, PS4 or anything. Uh, like that. I think. Yeah, I think it's a PC. Okay. All right. But, um, yeah. No, I love. I love the games. And the biggest thing about Five Nights at Freddy's is the lore of it and everything. Like right. the story, backstories, and this very dark, right. messed up plot and stuff so everyone's really excited to see what they're going to do with all of that in the films and of course i guess this is yet another you 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 were you were on the money with the last of us trailer so this of course is again another uh computer game adaptation which seems yeah. to be all the rage what well, even with the mario brothers the last of us and markiplier's new feature film coming out based on a horror game so. ah there you go now this stars matthew lillard who i didn't know who the hell he was but you say so i mean everybody knows him as shaggy in the scooby-doo live action films right but he's also um in the first screen film the ah. other murderer ah. I think there's two of them. okay he's one of them um but i love him he's okay perfect for this um and it comes Everyone's from Bloomhouse. Really and of course, and, and it then Josh Hutchison as well. Oh, right. Who's he? Games. Oh, um, of course. He? Oh, my God. That's him. Elizabeth God, he's grown Lowe. up. I know. Elizabeth Lau from uh, You. Oh, my God. Um, Quite a cast. Yeah. Oh, now, now I realise. Now it's they're all falling into place. It is exciting. And as I say, it comes from Bloomhouse, which is rather fantastic. And some people uh, were really worried, though, that they were going to kind of. I don't know, PG rate it a bit because apparently Five Nights at Freddy's originally was supposed to be a kids' game, which is. Hilarious. Oh, really um, but as soon as everybody heard that it was Bloomhouse, they were like, okay, so it's going to be scary, which is good because it needs to be gory. There you go. And Bloomhouse, actually, I've always worried that Bloomhouse have got a little bit sort of, what's the word, formulaic in their horror films, what with things like Truth or Dare and all that sort of stuff and Happy Death Day or whatever it was. They are, they're pulling out interesting, curious, genre bending sort of horrors. One of them being, was it Soft and Quietly? I think is the, the one on Amazon Prime at the moment, which I'm going to review. Really shocking, and the horror doesn't necessarily reside in a monster or anything supernatural. And Jordan Peele's a bit aren't they? Jordan Peele, oh, yeah. I yeah, think they are. Awesome. Oh, they yeah, are. Oh, there we go. Okay, so should we check it out? It's, it's a teaser. Welcome to Freddy Fazbear's Pizzeria, where fantasy and fun come to life. Hit it, guys. If you're watching this video, it means you've been selected as Freddy's newest security guard. Oh my god. We're going to have so much fun together. Oh, 
Excited. I'm so glad they've actually used animatronics as well. They've not CGI'd it. God. So it's like a ballpark place, isn't it's it? It's a play area. Well, it's yeah. a play area. Horror in a play area. Lends itself well, doesn't it? It's kind of like kiddie, re it's already retro. It's yeah. inherently retro. Yeah. Is Which that everything you were hoping be. it to be? Yeah, I mean, I'm just so, I'm so excited. Should we watch Everyone it again? I know is so excited for this. Let's watch it again. And that it's coming out on Happy Like Halloween as well. Oh, is perfect. it? Yeah. Welcome to Freddy Fazbear's Pizzeria, where fantasy and fun come to life. Hit it, guys! If you are watching this video, it means you've been selected as Freddy's newest security guard. Hello? We're going to have so much fun together. Wow, so I guess, it, yeah. So is he the monster? Is Freddy the monster? All the animatronics. All the yeah. animatronics. Are so clearly they're it's riffing on it. It's set in the 80s. There's obviously yeah. a time jump, but we're going to be in the modern day because it's now all smashed up and derelict, isn't it? No, I think it's no. still retro. It looks like they're kind of going back in time. I like the VHS, VHS camcorder. All that kind of, that's, I mean, the weird thing is, I tried to play it for one night about, it's been around for years, isn't it? About 10 years ago. Yeah, I think ago. it came out when... I yeah, think more than that. Probably. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's but awesome. when I tried to play it, a I couldn't get anywhere, and b I just felt uneasy. Yeah. Save by the bell. Oh. 